Hey YouTube, it's Healthinator here, and today we're going to talk about immune boosting protocols. Everyone's concerned about their immune system, so we want to go ahead and, and get some information on that. Let me dispel one thing. Uh, some people out there are like, oh, there's nothing you can do for your immune system to boost it. That's complete nonsense. There's plenty you can do to boost your immune system. So uh, let's get started uh, with my actual, my personal immune boosting protocol. So first up on the list, vitamin D. Crucial, crucial for the immune system. Actually, some of you may not know, but vitamin D is actually a hormone. Yeah, interesting. Uh, as we know, in the summer, vitamin D comes from the sun, but in the winter months, no sun, so it's crucial that you get vitamin D, especially in those winter months. Uh, vitamin D helps to activate T cells, aka killer cells, that help to detect and destroy foreign pathogens like viruses and bacteria. So vitamin D is crucial, crucial for the immune system, number one. Uh, you want to have that for sure. Um, next up, another powerhouse, vitamin C. Vitamin C, you really got to have this uh, for a functioning immune system. Uh, vitamin C helps the production of white blood cells, helps lymphocytes and phagocytes, and protect the body from infection. Vitamin C helps with white blood cells forming more efficiently, actually functioning more efficiently, I should say. And it also protects from free radicals. Vitamin C is also crucial for defense as an antioxidant for the skin. So it keeps your skin uh, nice and clean, healthy, and strengthens that barrier from infections. So you definitely want to get on the uh, vitamin C. That's definitely. Next up, you don't hear a whole lot about is zinc. Zinc is the most essential mineral for developing immune cells. So you want to get on that. It aids in the communication of cells. It has a role in inflammatory response. Works with T cells to destroy viruses. T cells are regulated by zinc. Zinc also aids in the, in, in the decrease of respiratory tract infection. Zinc deficiencies, deficiencies can impair your immune system. So you want to make sure you're getting zinc, three powerhouses. Another one which is not really thought of too much is probiotics. Probiotics are awesome because a lot of your immune system comes from that healthy bacteria. So what do they do? Um, it basically helps protect uh, and get rid of harmful bacteria. It promotes the natural um, uh, promotes natural antibodies. Definitely want those. It boosts immune system IAG cells, T lymphocytes, known as natural killers. Again, those T lymphocytes take care of all that bad stuff in your body. So you want to make sure you're you're aiding these guys and you're helping them uh, with with these minerals and nutrients to basically so they can function properly. Uh, it also keeps your intestinal tract. Uh, working properly. So another thing too, you want to get on those. And last, this one's free, is sleep. Proper sleep is crucial for uh, for your immune system. So you want to try to get to bed roughly at the same time. You want to get those seven and eight hours in because that's really going to help boost you. So all of these together along with a diet, a good diet and exercise is going to give you a killer immune system. So it'll basically give you a strong defense. So um, again, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe to my channel and get on the new boosting protocol. Do it now.